if you haven't seen the show, uh, this girl Lauren was marrying Andrew, and when she first walked down the is aisle, he the firefighter dude that yes. used to be a school teacher, he's a good-looking guy, school teacher. I thought, why isn't this guy already snapped up a hottie? Mm. So she walks down the aisle. She's not too keen on the fact that he's not tall enough. Yeah. Uh, so that puts her off initially, and you can tell she's like, oh, yeah, no. And then she warms to him as the night goes on, and yeah, then, he's, he's not he's not hard on the eyes. This bloke, he's not ugly. No. And then they, she tells him she has a child, which she was really nervous about. Because yeah. she does have like an eleven-year-old, I think. But he was an ex-school teacher, so he's perfect. And he he was fine with it. And then they started getting on really well. And then they were getting really kissy and touchy. And yeah, it was, she was, seemed to she be. She had a leg great. over him in bed and everything. And I thought, oh, these two are definitely going for penna. All was great. They were going home. We all thought, okay, they're definitely going to sleep together. Yeah, hundred percent. Then the cameras obviously left, and yeah. then they decided to go out for the rest of the night. So they went to Bondi. Right. And I think they were about to go into Ravisi's or something like that. And she does the runner. She gets in a cab, and she's never seen again. And he's sticking around in Sydney, the poor guy, just waiting for her for three days. And yeah. then He must have heard what the Bondi girls are like. They can vanish for days at a time. Really? And need to resurface and see everything's fine. So the producers brought her back to come face to face with Andrew and explain to the poor guy what went wrong. Why did you do the bolt? Oh. And uh, she sort of said it was because, you know, she had a lot to lose with the kid. She freaked out that she, she was going to get her heart broken. And she didn't so, think about this before? That's what I was thinking. TV show. Yeah, why did she do it in the first place? And uh, and then he just decided that he wasn't going to give her a second chance and said, no, nah, it's over. He so flipped he it on her. he flipped it on her. She oh. was prepared to to, you know, give him a second chance. Give him a second chance? Well, because she realised he actually was great with kids and he was willing to go the distance, regardless of her being a single mum. Right. So he joins us on the phone now. Andrew, good morning. Andrew, you must have thought, what have I done? Like, yeah. What's going on here? Yeah, a little bit like that, guys. Hey, pleasure to chat to you, by the way. Oh, and thank well, you. Um, Great to hear that you think I'm good looking, mate. Uh, mate, you are, I saw you on the TV and I thought this chick's going to love this guy. Yeah, and then all that stupid <laughs> height difference thing, like uh, that's not. Even oh, a the height is such a big deal on married at first sight with yeah. all the girls. Everyone's talking about if height. If you're shorter than the, if you're shorter than the girl, it's an instant turn off for these. I've girls, got a mate it? who's like short, and yeah. every girl he dates is six foot tall. They love him. All oh, right, I see. Weird. <laughs> So, 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 Andrew, yeah, look, I don't know I, what it is. I don't I just, know what it is. I'm not a short guy. Can I oh. ask, when the camera's less, when you guys are all kissy-feely and she had the leg thrown over <laughs> in bed, was there any... What happened after the camera's Oh, yeah, off? they definitely did. Did you, did you get her gear off? What happened there? No, look, I had I had my fingers crossed, but... Oh, uh, Jesus, no, I didn't no, know where he was going with that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, your fingers were crossed, um, everyone, right? Yep, yep, yep. But nothing, <laughs> you, you, you didn't get a nude? No, oh, oh, Kyle, Kyle. What? Um, we all want to know. <laughs> no, we headed out. We headed out. So, oh. that, and look, that was just a, a little bit of, you know, a grab of us, for the want of better words, of us uh, <laughs> just lying in the hotel bed, and then we shot off to meet um, the wedding guests out uh, out on the town. And when did she oh. bail? Well, I was at the QT in Bondi, name drop, yeah. um, and then well, that became uh, that became our apartment. Right. Um, and we went down the bottom uh, and then across the road to whatever the pub is on the corner there. Um, they actually denied us entry. We put some cups down. Yeah, no, so, look, it wasn't due to intoxication or anything, anything like that. Because I heard um, on, the, on, on one of the magazines said that the reason she did the runner is because you were denied entry and you got a little aggressive. Is that true? <laughs> yeah, or? look, I've heard there's a few crazy things floating around. It was nothing of the sort. The doorman was actually great as a... A short Kiwi bloke, <laughs> short, short of the way. Yeah, this this whole conversation. <laughs> yeah, barely legal. Uh, no, no, he was a lovely guy, and uh, look, we were both still with it. Um, I tend to think Lauren might have had a little bit more to drink than me, but um, we were fine. We were fine. It was more to do with the fact, apparently, that um, we'd placed some drinks down near a full bin that. Uh, could have squashed them in, apparently. Um, so oh, I just so they're very anal, well. these places. Everyone's trying to deny people entry for nothing. So they denied you entry. You turn around and she's in a cab? Is that what happened? That's exactly what happened. I just chatted to the bouncer probably another 30 seconds, saying, oh, okay, so, yeah, I get it. It's littering. Um, yeah, sorry about that, mate. Turned around. Literally. Lauren was nowhere to be seen. There's a taxi rank a few metres away. Um, and I sort of looked around and then <laughs> I, she literally vanished. I, I, I thought... A taxi didn't even enter my mind, but then after a minute or so, I thought it must be. So I walked up to the next guy in the taxi rank, and he said, "Yeah, she's she's 
jumped in the uh, taxi in front and took off in the other direction. Oh, how and how many times did you try and call her over the next few days? Look, it looked like there was a few there, but um, I look, a couple. Um, yeah, not too many. I look, once you don't hear back, you don't hear back. And, mm. you know, smartphones are pretty good these days. You can see when there's a missed call. Um, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Did you nothing, text her? I did, yeah, I did. It was mostly text, to be honest. And she read it? You can see that she read it? Oh, yeah, good point, Kyle. I, nah, Some nah, of them nah, don't nah, come up yeah. as red. I don't know, I don't know if that's okay. okay. oh. yeah. yeah, look. Now, yeah. do you reckon that she went and had ex sex with someone else, or what, or do you think she just went home? <laughs> Um, gee, I, I don't know. Um, I, no, I look, I honestly don't know. She had a lot going on, on in her life. Did you uh, sleep with anyone point. during these couple of days in between where you weren't sure? <laughs> no, look, I was. I had my bottom lip hanging out. I was just uh, moping, moping on the uh, in the hotel room. Man, that's terrible. I, I, I feel the whole thing. Has your ego recovered from this now? Um... Yeah, sort of. It's just, you know, very surreal watching yourself um, on TV. And I'm actually moving at the moment, so packing boxes last night, um, looking at the telly. And, and uh, yeah, it's a weird feeling. So I don't know where the ego's at. Um, once uh, once I've moved, we'll, we'll see. Do you have a girlfriend now? Um, everything's just happened so quick. I'm happy to chill out and, and do my thing. So, so is I'm that a no? Just cruising. Cruising. What does that mean? It means he's got a little yeah. something, something on the side, but he doesn't want to go no, 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 doing no, no, Facebook no. official do you, quite yet. Do you have a girl that you are seeing in some capacity? <laughs> um, what? Uh, not necessarily, no. What does that mean? That means he's That's probably he's probably going through a couple of them, but nothing special. No, 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 oh, no, 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 no. no oh, well, you clarify it. No, no, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm. Have I'm, you gone to blokes? At the moment, so. <laughs> no. Sorry to just disappoint you, Kyle, but yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Mate, look, I think you were you you presented on TV everything I saw as a good, honest guy who just never found the right woman. I believed everything you said. I, I was devoted that she she mm. bailed on you. I think it was a, a shit go. Um, do you, do you, are you watching it anyway? Yeah, I have been. Look, I'm I'm good mates with all the um, other participants, and yeah. um, you know they were almost my lifeline when. Um, you know, when it was all going down. So it was great to have that support there. Um, yeah, I'm glued to it. It's great. Okay. Maybe if you were Polynesian, you'd be able to give that old Democrat. <laughs> <laughs> yes. How's her form? Oh, oh you seem nice. Of the hundred that they yeah. interviewed. Yeah, you <laughs> seem nice, but I was really hoping for a Polynesian <laughs> man. He must have thought, what the <laughs> hell? Are you? Did you say that? Yeah, I'll wash I'll all your clothes. For an islander, maybe I'm half a chance. Maybe, maybe, maybe you. I'm thinking, would you go an old bird like that? <laughs> oh, she's a bit. Uh, she's in pretty good nick. She is. Um, she's yeah, a bit of airy fairy. I'm just the saying. Best guy going around. I'm just saying. Some trips you just never come back from. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah right. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm thinking. Andrew, all the best for you. We're loving the show. Married at first sight. It's on Channel Nine. Yeah. yeah I, I didn't think I'd watch that show. I thought, oh, watching this. This is the first time I've seen it. I've, I've not I, seen it. I thought I'm not interested in this stupid show, and, and now I'm like a oh, I'm like a, a, a mum that runs home to watch Bold and the Beautiful. <laughs> Every I can't I can't. Not watch.